Christina Pearson. I'm Rachel Grumbine. And it's for the past couple of years, we've been shoveling this whole bus stop because we have residents here who either don't hire or don't shovel the sidewalk. And as you can see over here, this is one of the issues and none of the kids can walk up here. We none did call. Walk. It's all ice now, so we can't remove it. And all these kids got to walk in the street. And these kids are, you know, in range from three Little years kids. old all the way up to nine, high ten school. years old. And we got high and schoolers got to stand on the corner over um, there in the year, road. we had one of the moms actually fall here and she busted her knee open. And that's about it. Well, we come so, you know, up here every year about. shoveling and we can't shovel four corners like this. Not when it's this much snow. No. Complaints to the town had the news come in, and that really all this was, was their attempt at, at clearing the streets right here. What I do you brought think? extra shovels up this morning to help shovel, but it's nothing but ice. The well, mayor was already contacted, and he decided to have everything plowed, but there's still no room for any of the kids to stand there. What do you think the resolution to the problem should I think be? They really need to come out forceful with these residents saying, you know, it's not even about you have 24 hours to clean up your sidewalk. I think it should be done right away to avoid any, you know, ice forming and then you really can't get anything out. I mean, I understand, like, this one right here, she's a little, you know, older in age, she's older than us, so I understand she can't physically come out here and shovel, but I think she could hire somebody. I mean, this is all her property that we're selling and taking care of at this point. I brought out extra shovels to have other people shovel. We have somebody brought salt out to salt. and But you can't have 80 kids at a bus stop at one corner. The kids cannot get up to Freeman School without walking in this road over here. And it's dangerous how the cars are going to hit them. If it's not one of us, it's going to be one of the kids. It's going to be the crossing guard. Somebody's going to get hit. One of the cars went around the bus. And this bus had to stop sign now. And technically, they're supposed to stop and wait, but the bus went around. It went around the bus. I mean, the, the car went around the bus. And you can see that on the news footage. 